That's the drone up there. Sharp sound. Sharp sound. Going back to Ondo State, I have left Edo State. Oh, oh goodbye, Edo. Welcome to Ondo State. Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are in the world. I remain your G, Aranga. Okay now, yeah, today, <laughs> I'm sure from the title you already know where we are. Yeah, I'm at the boundary, at in the border between Ondo State and uh, Edo State. Yeah, where we are is the, uh, they call it Ikaro. Yeah. Ikaro, and uh, we have the Osse River here. Osse River, that's uh, here, yes. We have the Osse River here. Look at the bridge here. Can you see the bridge? Very narrow. Very narrow. It can only take one vehicle at a time. It can only take one vehicle. So here, like I said, is on those states. And once you step across the bridge, you have entered where? Edo State. So let's go. I have with me my friend, Prince Kamal Din Ademola Adeboye. So he's an indigenous of, uh, would I say, are, are you an indigenous of uh, Ondo State? You are not now. I'm not an indigenous yeah. of Ondo State, but so to say, I think I've spent some numbers of years in Ondo State. Wow. Where we are, I've spent up to close to two decades here. Wow. So I know virtually everything about the local government. Wow. We are working on Ose Bridge. Wow. That separates Ondo from Edo State. Wow. At our back there is where Ose local government stops. And we are moving towards Edo State which wow. serve as the beginning of Owen West local government. From the other, uh, the other end of the bridge, you get to towns like Uzeba, Sabungidaora, Aochi, Afuze, Ekpoma, Agenebode, uh, and so on and so forth. You can also take this place to Benin. Most of the commuters that travel from Akure, the state capital of Ondo State, take this route to Onicha to buy their goods and they ply this road on a daily basis. basis. Funny wow. enough, the bridge is so narrow to the extent that it can only contain a vehicle at a time, like my friend has rightly said. Wow. Wow. So this is the Osse River? This is the Osse River. Can we move closer to the Osse River can then? I will get down into the river. Okay. Let's get down to the Osse River and see how the Osse River really look like. This is a, can you see? This can only take one vehicle at a time. Wow. So, hey, hey, hey. Like say welcome to Edo State. <laughs> Goodbye to Ondo State. <laughs> wow, can you see that? The border between Ondo State and Edo State. Another vehicle is coming behind us. You can see. It can only take one vehicle at a time. You can see how narrow the bridge is.
So we are already in Edo State now. Wow. Um, there used to be fights between the two states on a yearly basis. Every <coughs> Sorry. November, December of every year. Edo State will lay claim to the ownership of this river. And on those states will also lay claim to the ownership of the river. But basically the river belongs to on those states. So when the dry season is drawing near, people from Edo will come and fish in the river. People from Mundo State will also come to fish in the river. And there used to be a sort of clash somehow. Each community or each uh, state link claim to the ownership of the of river. The river. Wow. It usually takes the intervention of God for the disputes to be managed. And this has been happening every year. Wow. We are very close to the bank of the river. Like my friend has said earlier on. We are gradually moving. What? Wow. The, this river? It used to fill to that level during rainy season. Are In you? fact, it even fill up to the the brim of the bridge. Wow! During rainy season, it's a very big river. It's quite it's quite unfortunate that we are in the dry season. That is why you see the river retaining a little little river. It used to be a mighty river. We are travelers do stop over to shower some fresh water and we have some tankers that also come to this place to fresh water from time to time and we have some fishermen that fish in the river over there and is that not a is that not a tree or whatever yeah uh, dead wood dead wood yeah uh, i think that will it will hang on that place as a result of uh, the flowing of the river during rainy season Flowing of the river wow. during rainy season. Yes, as you can see, you, you you notice that the construction of the bridge was done during the colonial era. Hmm. It was done during the colonial era, and that used to be how or the style the colonial master used to construct the bridge in those days. And the funniest part of it is is that the bridge is seriously solid. Hmm. The way it was constructed is solid, very, very, very solid and strong, very, very solid and strong. It's quite unfortunate I cannot enter into the river. Yeah. Oh, wow, yeah. We are here live and direct at Ose River, yeah, Ose River. Mm -hmm. And this is the boundary, yeah, the border between uh, Ondo State and uh, Edo State. And however, where I am now, what would I call this place? Edo State. This is Edo State. Edo State <laughs> so funny. At the other side of the river. The is other Ondo side State. of the river is Ondo State. Ondo State. Can you imagine that? Honestly, this is very, very surprising. I don't think you've seen any uh, video of this place before. But if you have seen, comment down below, let me know. Uh, yes, comment down below, let me know. So this is the border between Ondo State and Edo State. Yes. And this is Ose River. Ose River. So River Ose. 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 <laughs> yes. And the, the name of the river uh, bears the name of the local government in Ondo State. So. 
So I have actually, actually, that means that it's on those three that has it. That has it. Uh, let me put it away. Well, sorry. Uh, apology to the Edo State uh, people. I really don't know much about history. But if this place, I'm just looking at it, that if this place, the river is called Ose River, and uh, there's a local government here in Ondo State that is called Ose Local Government. So virtually, it's like uh, it's more to the Ondo State side. I guess that is why perhaps they are, they, they, they are very attached to it than Edo State. So I guess that's just it. So the drone is moving up and down. It's going round. This will give you the real footage of the bridge that you've been passing through all these years. Honestly, I'm sure some of you will be surprised to say this. That's the drone up there. And the river is very calm. Do they have a fish here? Yeah? Ah, very, very big fish indeed. Big, big fish. Wow. Big one. What's that? You hear the, the sound of monkey. Is that monkey? Yes. That is monkey. Where's is, where is the monkey? In that place. That dim forest from the Hindu state. Anyway, let's go back and uh, meet uh, J-Boy and uh, Joseph. So this is Ose River. So we are already in Edo State. We will do a proper tour of Edo State very soon. So but that will be in our next trip. So uh, virtually we are completing uh, all the Yoruba speaking states now. And uh, Ondo state happens to be the last state that we are visiting in Yoruba speaking state. We've been to, we started from Lagos, Badagri. We moved to Ogun state. From Ogun state, we moved to Oyo state. From Oyo state, we moved to Kuara state. We've been to um, Oshun State and uh, we've also been to A Kiti State and to crown it we are now here live and direct in Ondo State never mind I'm on the Edo State territory telling you this but we're not going into Edo State so we just want to show you the border or let's say the boundary between Ondo State and uh, Edo State. Are they selling this sound? Yeah. Where did they get this sound from? From the river. From this river? Yes. Uh -uh. Edo people, not Ondo State. Okay, it's Edo people. Edo people. Wow. They pass the sound from the river and they sell it at exorbitant rate. Seriously? Yes. This is the type of sand they used to build and mold blocks in Edo states. Sharp sound. Sharp sound. That's uh, J-Boy and uh, Joseph. They just finished uh, flying the drone. I'm sure you will enjoy the footage, the drone footage. This is the other side of the river. <laughs> this is the other side of the river. And uh, this is uh, where we went to. Wow. These are people going to Edo State.
Where? Oh, wow, wow. Oh, wow. See you. This one is like a Kuya, tilapia. And do they hit the fish? Wow. Going back to Ondo State, I have left Edo State. Oh, oh goodbye, Edo. Hey, hey, welcome to Ondo State. Welcome to Ondo State. Till I come your way, same time, same channel, with another wonderful and interesting video. Is your Giarenga saying goodbye and then, oh, double. Oh. Uh -huh.